All right, welcome back to Room Break. We're done with Love Holic, so let's go to the next rooms series. Memory of Murder. Ooh. That's right. So we're playing Keith in this one. This is a totally new story, nothing to do with it. Keith, as you can see, is in uh, his psychiatrist's office, maybe. Just thinking about murder. Mm hmm. Now, this hypnosis can control someone's memories, you know, and that is weird. Control? How do you control memories? Well, I don't know, but Dr. Alice here, uh, this is, says this is the only way we can prove our innocence, so we have to trust her hypnosis, all right? Okay. She looks like she doesn't know what she's talking about and is reading from a pamphlet on hypnosis. <laughs> it's really a clipboard, but she's holding it backwards, actually. And so hmm. here's the totem. I could use that item to escape a room. <laughs> or break one. Or break one. Yeah. Mm-hmm. This is working really well. I'm actually hypnotized right now. <laughs> All right. So get re get yourself ready for new challenges, okay? Okay. I'm glad update will be constantly provided. Oh, yeah. Or extraordinary ability purchased at the shop. Mm-hmm. Well, it's kind of cheating if you use a GPS to escape the room. <laughs> Google. Wow. So, this is some Matrixy Inception kind of shit, I guess. Doctor, but... have you considered getting glasses that fit? So, this is kind of weird, but apparently the doctor can communicate with us, which I guess is makes sense for hypnosis, but she also seems to see the room somehow. Mm. Is her last name Alice? I th oh, obviously it is. Uh, right. Yeah, we're not supposed to name our uh, know our name is Keith yet, but we'll we'll learn it. Okay. So we soon will start. We'd start to believe in no. And also notice they kept the same word balloons, but this time replaced everything with a giant check mark that says "new text here." Mm -hmm. Uh, it's a good question. So this is the way hyp hypnosis kind of locks you in a room in your brain. That is the same room that you are currently in. Yes, and that is how you'll prove your innocence of murder. Okay. Oh, um, wait, look at this. I haven't done anything, especially anything wrong. I've literally done nothing with my life. I have many <laughs> regrets. I should do things. <laughs> Yeah, but Doc, how how's this gonna with the whole memories and shit? Because this a is like out. the present. <laughs> what? Just think of this as a dry run for if you actually do get convicted and go to prison. Because <laughs> that's a hell of a more challenging room to escape, friend. <laughs> You're gonna find too about ninety nine percent of the rooms in Room Break have the hammer lying around. Hmm. So let's break a window. Wait a minute, I'm lucid dreaming. I can just imagine myself a key. <laughs> By the way, these are really annoying rhythm games to do on a phone. I don't know if I mentioned that before, you but did. they really, really are. Okay, sorry. I, I have to reiterate it. Mm -hmm. Anyway, here's our golden key we have for no reason. <laughs> Stupid big hands. All right, so let's solve puzzles the only way we know how, apparently. Freud would be proud. I hope you don't mind 20 more minutes of hammering things and playing them. No, I'm kidding. But, um... D do they innovate on the minigames between episodes? No. They, okay. No, I'm sorry. They really don't. And even worse, they get harder, so... A anyway. three-piece screwdriver set? What a great deal! <laughs> Is this an Escape the Room game or the Home Shopping Channel? <laughs> All right, now that we've divided that, we can uh, right. use this to open up this panel, right? Sure. Okay. Now here's what... There we go. And that's going to open the window, and that's going to be a serious part of the... The theme here is going to be based on this, all right? So is Dr. Alice just taking, like... Well, this vision of Dr. Alice just taking notes and observing you, not helping at all? Oh. I don't know. There's even a music change just for this. For this terribly awkward code we put in, but... He's beautiful-minding. <laughs> so 
See, now she can see it, so I guess she's just a hallucination of his. Is that maybe what's going uh, on? Dr. Alice has eyes in the back of her head. I see. Yeah. You know, zero, one, two, and three numbers you'd be familiar with. I feel like with. I've Wait. seen them before when I first learned counting. What the? What's interesting? Uh, memories. What did we see, like, floating numbers before? Oh, yeah, right before I killed that guy. <laughs> the window. <gasps> what? Huh? But, Dr. Alice, your office has windows. <laughs> And only one is transparent, strangely. Whoa, hey, Wait, what the? Uh -huh. That's a lot to extrapolate for someone who's trying to prove my innocence here, Doctor. I mean. All right, I believe My you. image of Dr. Alice, you're a real jerk. <laughs> oh, you're repeating what I put in the safe. Surely you want to murder me and my family and everyone I love. Mm -hmm. No, all right, I buy that. Yeah, it's just fair. for it's now, fair. though. Yeah, seems right. legit. I'll testify on your behalf. <laughs> well, I will keep my eyes on the window if you move. Yeah, actually. All right, doctor, we get I've it. I've already okay? forgotten what comes before three. Okay, there you go. Cool. So now we do that, and success. So a window was significant to. The incident? No. I'm, I'll spoil that. No. It's significant to us, but they don't really explain how or why or anything. Hmm. I feel like most people have come across a window at some point. Well, hey, I, uh, I S ranked it. Oh, at least. nice. Ooh, another enjoyment playing our game. Dr. Alice will be impressed. Well, um, that's... Uh, what do you think of memory or murder so far? I'm curious as to the nature of this murder. It's, like, weird, but it's definitely a little more interesting than Loveholic. Okay. It's going to turn out Dr. Alice was dead this whole time. Don't, and we're going to have different rooms this time. It's not the same room five oh. times. So don't worry about I know that was the most interesting oh part boy. of the break. Escape the doctor's office. Love out, player. <laughs> oh, man, more mobile strike. Why is my memory so messy? Let's see. Here is... A room. <laughs> now break it. <laughs> Fucking break that shit. Apparently, the first murder scene. Oh my god, that cactus was murdered. <laughs> I was here for... Reasons? Oh, so I was being interrogated and the police brought me to the <laughs> they crime They started asking scene. some tough questions, so I killed the interrogator. <laughs> There wasn't any evidence found that proved me guilty. There wasn't any <laughs> evidence found that proved me guilty. There's no place like innocence. There's no place like innocence. <laughs> Wait, what? So how is this helping? <laughs> Dr. Alice Quack? <laughs> this is, yeah, I, I don't know, uh, Dr. Alice, if you're really a good doctor can't wake up and i'm not gonna give you any copay for this <laughs> it's not it's doing the opposite dr alice this is not helpful in where my mind <laughs> all right is this like black mirror the police watching this <laughs> all right i don't know where we're gonna use a key to open a bag exactly but we'll figure something sure. out Oh, the window. Remember that's important? All right, this will be good pr good practice for when I mess with the real murder scene. <laughs> is Blood Erase another mobile game we can play? Well, blood is the thing that transports oxygen to... Oh. Hmm. hmm. Did I try to erase some blood? That doesn't even make sense. That's just the name of the nightclub across the street. I think this is a little unfair. There's like a crowbar that looks like a flat steel plate on the ground along this all this paper. Um, all right. So first things first, let's open up the police officer's bag, okay? Of course. Now we get 
<sighs> a bunch of shit we have to divide for no reason. Yep, okay. We get a, a, a notebook that says Luminol plus blood, right? Okay. If you don't know your Phoenix right, by the way, Luminol is like that shit you spray on blood to make it like glow oh, in the dark, okay. also right. semen. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So, now that we have Luminol spray... Now I can see where my memory thinks the blood is and prove my innocence. <laughs> right? Huh? Alright. Oh, no, yeah, that sounds about right, yeah. Alright. So, um... Alright, we see some blood here. Uh away from the body for some reason. I don't quite know how that Just works. Just some projectile spit, probably. Did the body fall onto slippers and some broken glass, or...? I can't get inside this chalk outline. No, it's not possible to get past that barricade, so... Oh, right. <laughs> let's... yeah. So let's, uh... Let's win a golden key. Mm -hmm. Which is nothing. And then we'll take scissors, okay? A golden key for a chance to tour Willy Wonka and his police barricade. Oh. <laughs> or just... <laughs> Let's just ruin the police barricade. Spray luminol on blood. And then use the giant oversized <laughs> lever to turn out the lights. Ah, uh, he left his screen name behind. <laughs> Should have put Twitch TV under that. Dr. Alice, I want to talk to you for a minute. My name is Keith7230. <laughs> <laughs> You're right, prisoner seven two thirty. Classical way. Mm hmm. <laughs> <laughs> what the? <laughs> These wacky memories. Wait, how is that convincing? And uh, you know, I do charge by the hour, so <laughs> just want to remind you that something has set me up. What an effing joke. <laughs> Q.E.D. Arrest this man. Oh, you're right, Dr. Alice. None of this matters. <laughs> Thanks for reminding me. <laughs> well, yeah, I thought that was how this worked. These are all fucking fakes. Capital <laughs> F fucking. Proper noun fucking fakes, mother... I, Keith7230, am not the murderer. <laughs> I swear. We'll see. We have many more, um, <laughs> quote-unquote rooms to break. We've got a lot more time to waste, Keith. Dr. Alice, when are you done adjusting your glasses? <laughs> Never. Can't get them quite right. Alright, so we'll turn on the light, we'll get the key. Put in our last name. Success. Room break really knows how to dress up the tiny victories in life. And, uh... Alright, so... That accomplished. That's another room. <laughs> room broken. Oh. Yeah. Well, there was a memory of a murder that lives up to the title, at least. That's okay. there is that. That's yeah. The thing. No. <laughs> well, fuck. This room is fucking broken. Right. Fucking room breaks. Hashtag blood race. All right. Hashtag Keith7230.